Hi guys, how are you doing? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please hit subscribe. For those of you already here, thank you so much for watching my previous videos and liking them. Thank you so much, I appreciate that. Today guys, I want to talk to you about things that I wish I knew before I started the UGIS. These are the things that I wanted, uh, I wish people had told me about before I started doing UGIS. So first of all, I really wish I knew that after taking this course, it would be so hard to explain to people what I do. I don't know if you guys have experienced this, but even before I, I started first year, just after, you know, being called by your school, and then you're telling people that this is the course I'm doing. Like for me, when I usually tell people, the course that I did was geomatic engineering and geospatial information system. Just that sentence, it's very long, but like, what is that? I don't know if you guys have experienced that, but for me, that's something that I've experienced so much, not even with just my family, even people that you meet, people are like, what is that? What is just passion? You know, it's so hard explaining. So, I don't know, uh, for me, I guess now I've realized that you just have to tell people what JS is for you, because JS is really wide, so there won't be a day that you it, it is going to be easy to tell people that you are doing JS and JS is this. It's, it's not easy to explain. This is a cause that seems that people haven't known so much about it, especially here in Kenya. So I wish I knew that. I mean, every time explaining to people, oh, JS is this, JS is this. Yeah, so that's one of the things. The second thing is, I wish I, wish I had done now. Um, uh, computer science basic course even before I started this because clearly things to do with computer stuff they are really linked to GIS so I wish I had done some basic technical stuff like to be technical to know these things about computers of course I did the the basic computer packages that offer that you, people usually do after high school but clearly that was not enough so I wish I had done some computer stuff. Something else is I wish I had started doing programming way earlier. So for me, uh, when we started first year, okay, we all knew we were supposed to do programming, but it's not really easy to find that inspiration to, to do programming. Okay, for me, I'm not really an expert right now, but I keep trying to encourage myself to do more programming. For JS, programming is very important. You need it to be able to do so many things. I also wish that I knew that JS is applicable everywhere. That JS can be used in all fields. This is because geography is everywhere in the world. So I wish I knew that. I wish I knew that JS um, has so many things. You can never finish learning JS. There's so many things that are there to learn in JS. So me when I was in first year, I was trying to make sure that I understand everything in JS. I used to tell myself, I want to do Python, I want to understand web JS programming, I want to understand Java, all those programming stuff. But I didn't know that. There's so many things. If I decide that I want to learn so many things about JS, I will never finish. So what I wish I knew is that JS is so and so. I could be able to focus on one thing and be good at it. So whatever you're going to sell in the industry world is what you're good in. Whatever you're good in in the JS sector. This applies to all careers. I mean, you can never finish learning things about your career. There's so many applications here. So if you decide to specialize in one thing, that's the thing that can be your thing. So you wish I really knew that, that I can find something that I like in JS able to focus on that because doing trying to do everything is not only necessary. So guys I wish I knew all these things about JS before I did this course. But now that I know I really hope that I, that the fact that I've told you guys is going to help you. So this is the end of my video. Thank you so much for watching and please hit subscribe button. Thank you.